My hair is so wet, but can we just talk about this makeup look? My gosh, it looks so blurred. Period. If you want to get more matte lipsticks, I have this one. I just don't think it matches with the look. Well, actually, it kind of does because this eyeshadow color but today we're going to an indian restaurant so i'm gonna be vlogging showing you guys all the food the restaurant is like an indian restaurant like south indian food and stuff like that we're Never done eating, eating guys Mango lassi. Look at this, so cute. I know they have a mirror here, but I don't know. But you guys tell me, do I look cute with a bucket hat? Look at this bag. Purr. I've seen the same bag on Amazon. This is like trendy as hell, too. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Look at these ones. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Let me see. They're <laughs> both <laughs> <laughs> well, I go to run there, right? <laughs> they're huge, I mean, they're like hella blurry. They're not actually nice. These cargo pants are so cute, but they don't have uh, any small. The next day. we are back home i look mad oily like like look at them pores sticking out but i literally didn't even do that much makeup so i did this hairstyle in the car i don't even know what it looks like but i'm just gonna take it off now because my it's giving me a headache lightweight and i'm gonna just show you guys my outfit too this is like my one of my favorite like punjabi suit it's super pretty like i really like the color combination too so yeah let me just take my hair out I really don't know what else to put in this vlog because today I, I'm not doing anything. But ooh. Oh my god. I think I should have left it in there. Okay, natural. Oh. This is so pretty. 
Okay, I think I should have just left it in braids because sometimes I get like really pretty hair, you know. But I'm gonna use this like new um hair product that I got, and let me show you guys it's this so one right here. I have actually um tried their products before from this brand. I think it's called Virtual. I don't know. I think. And it's a really good brand. I've tried the shampoo and conditioner. It really smells amazing and it's so freaking good. So this is called Curl Defining Whip. It's like a mousse. So it has like this like whip thingy. So it's for curly hair, which I kind of have like curly wavy hair. I'm not really straight. It's never straight. So I don't know. Let me just get some. I kind of forgot to use this. Okay. <laughs> wait. Oh wait, how did I use? Oh. I think that's enough. Alright. All right, well, I'm gonna do one it. side for you guys and then the other side. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna use all of it. Actually, I'm gonna use like both sides. Ooh, this looks crazy. Alright. Alright, I did wash my hair today, so like and this stuff smells amazing. It smells like coconut low key. Kinda tastes like coconut and like rosy. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more just onto the, my bottom layers. And this is supposed to make your hair like curly a little, which is interesting. So that's what I'm gonna do. Look at that. Already have I got too much. <laughs> oh wait, it like fades, like low key. Okay, I literally got so much product on this side, but it's fine. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side too now because I put way too much on this. We do another part of hair care routine, but I don't know when because like I don't know. I don't have like all of my hair care products or whatever. I'm thinking of doing a different kind of a hair care product, probably like like my shampoo, conditioners, and like what I use in my hair, hair care products, like you know stuff like that. Cause last video that I did it was just about like hair oils and stuff. That's like really hard to come out. Okay, well, okay, we only need a little bit. So yeah, I'm also gonna make a video of my only, I think lip glosses next. Yeah, I, because last time I did um lip glosses, so this time I need to do. Wait, last time I did matte gloss. Wait, last time I did matte. Yeah, now this time I have to do lip glosses. So stay tuned for that. I really need to come back and do more videos for you guys because it's been a while now. So yeah, I'm just gonna twist my hair. Let me so see. I do this with like whenever I come out of the shower and whenever my hair is wet. And I think this way it makes your hair curly and wavy. It's really natural. It's like you're going out and stuff. Like you want those full volume. But I usually just do this if I'm just at home and I'm gonna go out and stuff. Because it's just like natural, you know. Alright, let me just close this. And this is a 10 out of 10 product. You definitely need to basically take some hair piece and you're just kind of like wrapping it like this like overlapping it to keep taking section to section of hair and just keep going yes i'm a little bald right here i feel like that's like everyone i guess i don't really know why but i'm just basically creating like this type of a thing in the front i'm just gonna keep going in the back twisty thingies i have this like roller thing too which i don't know how to use but i really want to the rest of this hair, I'm just gonna go ahead and just twist it and make it a little bun. Look at the back. I know my hair looks crazy like this, but this is like how I usually do it. And it looks amazing in a bun. Basically like that. So for like my little baby hairs, which I have a lot of baby hairs. And I usually use castor oil and coconut oil. So yeah. this is my outfit. Okay, this is like Johnny. And this is like a really lightweight to me, like it's really pretty and stuff. And this is like a mesh, it's a really pretty. Like I really like the sleeves and stuff. And then a plaza. No. Yeah. No. Yeah, it's a plaza, y'all. Yeah. I thought it was a charada, but it's not. Charada is like more like flare and, and it has like that thing around it like to your your thighs and stuff but it's not that this is like a, a plaza it's like a pent pent style pent i really said pent pent style yeah all right i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys what i used and stuff for my face today 
um like earlier because i didn't get to really vlog it or do you my get ready with me or whatever because my phone was dying and i did not want it, it to die so yeah so oh, my skincare yeah. i did this moisturizer one of my favorite moisturizer ever like this product is like amazing it's like my holy grail i i don't know what it's about this but it's really freaking good it's from the behalf usa um to cream bomb all right my hair looking cute all right i really don't care what it looks like right now because it's messy so but this is how it looks like it's really freaking good you guys need to try it it's so freaking good okay on to the next product our foundation concealer Wait, this is not the concealer. Right, this is the concealer I used, and then this is the bronzer, not bronzer, contour I used. So for the foundation, it's like a foundation basically, but it's a tinted moisturizer. That's why it's like a really lightweight, and you can still see my skin through this like stuff, right? Right now, it's really messy or whatever because it's like matte oily. But yeah, and this is in the shade 32N. You guys think it much? I think it does. Okay. And then, then I use this Milani Cosmetic Under Eye Brightener. This is like my other holy grail product. This is so freaking good. I do definitely need to get another one. It's like a really lemony pinky color undertone. It's a, I use it as a concealer, which I don't know. I like it. So this is the contour stick that I use. It's from NYX Cosmetic in the shade Medium. You guys can tell it's really 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 messed up i do need to get on my and then for my brows i use the benefit cosmetic um gimme brow gel fiber gel i don't even know what shade this is even in this i think it's called three but i do need to get a bigger one because this is tiny as heck but then i also use the clear gel from um mac cosmetic it's a brow gel it's a really good gel for like just like you know anyway i don't really have to put anything in my brows because i literally got them done so like they already naturally look fully for the highlighter i used this anastasia glow kit and i used the shade butter squatch can't really see it in actually yeah, you can't see it there but yeah i used that i did forget to use primer but it's sort of fine uh i used the mac cosmetic glow clay best peachy blush this is a really pretty blush and it's great for the summer powder i use the Too faced uh, translucent setting powder it's a really good powder you guys need lastly, to try lastly for the lippy i use this color pop lipstick in the shade parker what happened to the sticker okay but this is in the shade parker since i already kind of have makeup on i should try this on here with with the for you guys so i already did a video on tiktok but i haven't posted yet but it's in my drafts so this is a silk fiber mascara long heavy volume when i tried this i literally used only one coat my lashes were so big like i struggle finding mascaras because my lashes always droop down or like they're just straight even though i curl my lashes like it's just i don't know what it is all right let me just show you guys this is how the wand looks like it's a thick wand i think i tiny thick wands so i'm just going to do one side without curling my um lashes and then the other side just I just without the curling my lashes and this is only one coat my lashes are really sticking up oh my god I, i'm i'm impressed it's just that uh, it smells a little cheap though but it's really good it works this side i'm gonna curl my lashes instead Alright, and this is a really pitch black mascara whenever I use like a face like remover, it's just like drooping down. I'm mostly going to do my bottom lashes. Can you guys tell me which side looks better? I kind of think this one looks better because it's curled. Oh my gosh, I'm low-key obsessed with this mascara. Like, oh my god, okay. I don't need to put this in box anymore. I can just keep this in my little collection because I'm going to be using this a lot now. Because this mascara, 10 out of 10. Look at it. 
just by one coat you guys this is amazing i will link it down below where you can get it from all right it's time to take my makeup off at this point because i want to watch some netflix and chill and just like you know do some other stuff and just like you know not how to be sitting in this all day so i just like my lip y'all so today i used these ones and the peach facial cleansing wipes and these are in peach it smells so good i have apple strawberry and i think another flavor pineapple and it's really 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 good because i don't have my cellar water anymore and it's all gone so i'm using this as my replacement okay now i am looking like this i'm just gonna toner my face and stuff yeah, I'll show you guys what toner I use because it's my one of my favorite. All right, this is the toner that I use from Skin Proud. It is a detox toner. First they had this pink one, now they have this new one in green, which I haven't used it yet because I still have this one. It's the same thing, but it just changed the color, and the color is like this green. If I can take it out, it's this color. It's a really pretty color. It's so pretty. You guys, tell me if you guys are team pink or team green obviously pink because i'm wearing pink but obviously i'm obviously i'm gonna love this one a lot it's literally the same thing it's just the colors are different all right and now we're just gonna kick some and it smells like freaking strawberries it smells so good for the products i'm gonna definitely use my daily moisturizer and I'm going to use this eye cream. It's a eye cream by eye cream and has caffeine and vitamin C. So it's like turmeric type. And then I also have this other product from the same brand. It's called Belief. And it's a hyaluronic 11% syrup. And it's double charged. I'm going to go ahead and apply this eye cream. It looks like this. It's like yellow. I use a little bit of this stuff. using the moisturizer i'm just gonna take some from the cap because there's a lot on here and yeah i also need to, to take some sunscreen too but i'm not even going out anywhere so but i still need sunscreen next i'm going to use this skin proud sunscreen this product literally melts into your skin or serum it's really hydrating i really like this one more than some other it's like this one is really hydrating i also use this other one it's from uh, I don't know how to say it. It's like Luna Lips. This is the one I'm talking about. It's really a good one. Um.